A bright comet has caught everybody by surprise, and you might be able to go out to see it in the night sky. I'm Michael Martin, and welcome to Late Night Astronomy. In mid-September, a comet that had avoided detection made its closest pass to the sun. And during that time, there was an outburst that led to a dramatic increase in its brightness. For the past several days, people in the southern hemisphere have been taking some incredible images of comet C2025R2 Swan as it travels past the star Spica and the planet Mars. If this comet stays intact, those of us who live in the northern hemisphere will start to have some really nice views of it as we approach October. To see it, go outside and face towards the southwest about 45 minutes after sunset. Low to the horizon, you'll find comet C2025R2 Swan traveling through the constellation Libra and making a close pass to the star Zubin Alganubi on October 1st. It can be difficult finding comets right after sunset because of the sky glow. One thing that I've done in the past is gone out about 45 minutes after sunset and used a pair of binoculars to look in the general area where the comet's supposed to be. As the sky continues to darken, it'll eventually pop into view. As we move deeper into October, the comet will travel into Ophiuchus with a close pass to the star Sabic on October 13th. As it moves through the Milky Way, Comet Swan will move by the Eagle Nebula on October 17th, which will provide an excellent opportunity for those of you doing astrophotography. Using a low-powered eyepiece giving me around 50 times magnification, I'll be able to see both of these objects in the same field of view. Comet Swan at this point is moving fast through the night sky and makes its closest approach to Earth around October 20th. If this comet holds together, it could give people all around the world some incredible opportunities to observe and image it throughout the month of October. And please let us know if you were able to see it and where you saw it from in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video, please like it and subscribe to this channel to get more updates on comets and other events in the night sky. Thank you all so much for your support, and clear skies from late-night astronomy.